This tutorial was based on one of our themes, which we used the same framework, just the different contents and the demo data. So, it might be slightly different from the theme you are using, such as logo, images, demo data, and some examples. However, as it is the same framework as you are using, you can follow this tutorial without any confusion. Okay, let's move on the payment options. So when you when we made uh, the listing uh, submit form, we didn't uh, enable the payment. So once it enabled, then you can see the select packages. So packages can be created uh, in the WooCommerce product. Let's see. We already created three of them. These are different. Uh, these are adders for the this this one. So if you see this one basic and uh, standard and gold and uh, you need to select the lava uh, package as a product data then you can see these filters and you can add the price and the sale price and uh, also icons for the price table and if it's included uh, free listings which is zero then you, you should select this one and listing limited how many listings they can uh, submit maybe i just wanna limit five ten is too many and the listing will be posted for uh, a year or like you can change 60 days and uh, the new listing status can be like a uh, pending because it's free and uh, admin can review and also you can add some the message for the pending if you want to use uh, different uh, templates for the basic and uh, also standard and gold also you can choose this is a really good one so i'm going to create a different templates for the each year payment after i explain this and uh, let's see the standard is a fifty dollars and uh, icon and uh, maybe uh, they can add like three. It will be posted uh, a year and they paid fifty. That's why I want to make a uh, publish immediately and also template and gold, the most ex expensive one and thirty hundred. But uh, we will give a discount for the two hundred and fifty. The uh, also icon. And uh, so they can add 10 and 60. Whichever you want, you can change them or customize them. And when we go back to the listing time, you can be able to choose like basic, standard, and gold. These are what we are using for the, this uh, listing type. And if you want to add some memo, you can also add on the, for the price table. So please select one of them or this is the memo and when you go to form now you can choose the packages let's say a uh, basic I don't want to show too many filters for the basic because it's free yeah, I just want to use uh, one two images and email only four filters i wanna let them use for the basic package then you need go here and choose basic and contents basic and images basic and also you can limit how many images they can add only one image because it's free one and email basic for standard we can let them use uh, like this for others and gold gold can add everything so let's uh, select them so basic uh, standard and gold can be here and uh, also this one is uh, not basic and gold and the listing category standard and gold and uh, standard and gold 
and then standard and gold and the standard and gold the content is uh, everybody everything and the future image also you can choose like that and also you can find the limitation so maybe standard i want to let them use 10 image uh six images but the gold they can add like more than 15 images because they pay a lot and uh, also map data is uh standard and uh, basic ups standard and gold and uh this one and the phone number gold and standard only uh gold members let them uh, use uh, the social network because they paid more so it's totally up to you i'm just making an example you can select whichever you want and hit the save so before it was showing uh, the form uh, immediately but uh, now it's different now it shows a price table and uh, these are what i purchased already i had some tests that's why you know it shows uh, you know what i purchased but basically it shows like that. When you purchase uh, any packages, then it will show like this. These are the package detail information what you made. So like five uh, listings they can add and the free listing. And uh, you remember this, right? And this information, it goes to the here. And the icons are basically from here. And uh, you can see the some uh, information about uh, this package also you can add uh, here you can add some uh, short description about uh, each packages and uh, the new listing states are pending and publish publish because it is, this is free and only one image they can add and then six images and 15 images gold can add and uh, and you can also see available filters when you click this one you may see copy name and contents detail page preferred email and or standard also they can add this much but gold they can add all so your user can see really easily what are included in the, these packages so and then when you click the basic then you will see only uh, a few filters and uh, this is a uh, standard form and this is uh, for the gold, so everything you can add. When you see this basic summary form, you see email arrange is not correct. So when you go to summary form, also it can be different with by uh, packages. So basic, maybe 50 I want to give. And the free preference also is basically 50 it might be. You can see it's gonna get like this. You can set the uh, all of different uh, width by uh, you know the packages. If it's not, it will follow the default width. So let's say if you wanna add some uh, banner on the basic only because it's free, then uh, you need to add HTML filter here and. Uh, save and uh, only let them show the basic and add uh, some temporary image and uh, go to then it will show only basic summary form see here but other summary form doesn't really doesn't have because you choose only for the basic package or if you wanna let them add a video 
for only standard and uh, gold packages also you can add here you should save once and uh, you, you can find this and you can select gold and the standard then basic doesn't have video but standard has a uh, video and also gold has the video so it's pretty much good to have different uh, you know packages and also different uh, filters and uh, the price can be set and the duration everything can be set and also the template is can be set by uh, different uh, packages and you see you can choose different uh, packages Basic, you might need to show only very simple four or five filters information. Also, you can add some more banners or Google AdSense or something. And the standard and the gold can be different template, uh, whichever you want. The template can be created or modified uh, here. So basically, you can uh, find the uh, you know, detail page here and then choose one of them and uh, duplicate it and uh, customize it by uh, each packages you can create new templates for basic standard and gold but uh, to save time we are going to uh, modify uh, some templates so let me duplicate the uh, existing template yes. i just uh, used the duplication plugin and duplicate it let me add uh, the new titles for the packages new basic template okay we changed the names uh, let's uh, assign them to the each product You don't really have to follow this way. Uh, as I told you, this is an example. Basically, you can make uh, different templates for the each uh, product and assign them. Then when your client uh, submit uh, the listing, then it will show with uh, the templates. Okay, so we assign them and now we need to modify the templates by the each product. So each product has different filters and uh, we need to remove the widget not to show and the show. So let me try the basic one. So the basic one has only one, two, three, four, five, five pillars. We duplicated a template which has a more uh, listening data. And now we need to remove them to match uh, the packages which is a base package and uh, it only has uh, a few you know filters right then you can find and remove them title you need uh, tagline you don't need and then uh, MLTs you don't show and this one also you don't show description nearby also you don't provide because you don't provide the maps and also tagline you don't provide and you can remove most of the things and maybe information also you don't provide and just name and the phone number and contact information whatever yeah pretty much like this if you want to remove uh, reviews for the basic templates also you can remove okay i think we have done and uh I've shown you uh, one of the packages and uh, the templates, how you can customize and modify to match with uh, the filters. I think you might understand, you just need to remove and uh, reorganize by the package filters. And uh, basically our uh, payment system is uh, you can create uh, the packages by uh, WooCommerce, which is a great plugin. And uh, you can assign the packages filters and uh, form and uh, you can also assign the different uh, templates i've shown you that uh, uh, only the same structure of a uh, template 
because we du duplicate it. Uh, it's only for the, you know, to make you understand better. You can also have a totally different uh, templates by the packages. Let's say uh, the basic template, you can add uh, like, you know, more banners or, you know, advertisement because it's free. And also the paid packages such as uh, standard and the gold, you can make it more like better style design and uh, fancy and more features you can add. So I believe this idea of uh, the package is a uh, little bit complicated than just automatically hiding and showing templates. But this kind of package is much better to have uh, flexible options. So you can, you know, especially I really like to have more design for the paid packages. Then your client will love and then, you know, they can buy. Okay. Uh, we've done and i hope you understand how it works and uh we might have uh, another tutorial how you can create a detailed template then you might understand better how easy it is and then you can have a better idea how you can make it for the each package templates okay if you have any questions please contact our support team i'm gonna come back with another tutorial Okay, I think we have done. Thanks for your time. And uh, if you have any problem or questions, please contact our support team. And please stay with us. We are planning to have more video and tutorials, including new template and new listing types. As you may know, our template and theme is quite flexible to build a different template and a different listing type and the website. I'm going to do some with you and I'm going to share how to do it and the files. Okay, thanks for your time and I'm gonna come back with another tutorial.